put him back in his safety mood chamber. Seems like a good place to be. <laughs> I like how he just pops up. Like, whoop. It's like he's in water. And he's coming up for air. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Let me put this lichen in there as well. And this herb. I can have Matlock process all of that. Yep. I won't say a thing until you bring me a pumice stone. A pumice stone? What use is that? What use are you? Could you please take it? Uh, I have a pumice stone. Can I please use it? Please? Please? There was a note in a vac tube on Sunset Boulevard. Was that from you? Ah. Sunset Boulevard. I send all my mail to Sunset Boulevard. I'll keep that in mind. Wait, what? Take red tag. Wait, did I give him the pumice stone and it, like, didn't even... What the fuck? Nothing suggested that I just gave him the pumice stone and yet it's gone and apparently it already happened. What? Oh my god, this game. Okay, thanks. What did you give me? Oh, red tag. Alright, I believe that is for Matlock. Yes. Well, at least it's a safe place. Ah, shit, I still don't have room for any of this stuff. Alright, well, I don't think I need the blue tag, and I don't think I need the green tag. Uh, I'm gonna take one anyway, because I'm gonna shove it in a locker. Wait, can I shove it in... In this locker? Is there any room in here? Ooh, hello. Okay. Put that in the locker. I'm gonna write that down just in case I run into a situation like the key again. I don't even know if my note's gonna make any sense when I go back to read it, but oh well. Alright, I've got three things to turn into potions. And actually, let's do... Let's do that before I... Um, before I use the red card. It says, when have I had an ant? Oh, I don't think I had room for it, so I never took it out. I give this chemical extractor one thumbs up. It looks like a super advanced KitchenAid mixer. Holy shit. Each herb makes three health boosts. Damn. Wait, 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 wait. Can I split these? You can't split them. <laughs> you, you're kidding me. You can't split the stuff you have, so I can't, like, cut my ammo in half and give it to the other people. I can't. Well, in that case, I'm not going to take the rest of the health boost, because then I'll have one stack instead of two. Wow. Alright, well, I think I better have at least one antitoxin with me, just in case I get poisoned. Because it'll probably cause damage over time, I'm guessing, and that's not something you want to have happening and not have an antidote for. 
I'm guessing I don't need two radios. Is there a locker in here? Yes. I just took a syringe. I didn't even know there was a syringe there. No room. Well, shit. Now I have another inventory item. Anyway, let's go use the red key. Which door do I use it on? Oh my god. I have no idea where to aim, because this game gives me basically no depth perception. Like, what? Okay, it's to the left of me, apparently. Here? Nope. Here? There we go. This is the door. Um... That doesn't look friendly. Interesting. Uh... That didn't work. The fuck is that? Try morphed animal. Oh sh! What? Oh god! Scream! Scream! <laughs> Try morphed animals. Were those cages of animals? And they transformed and formed like fucking flesh and joined together. It did say the different like basilisks and the. Caucus and whatnot were attracted to each other. Maybe they, maybe the different animals were infected with different bacteria and they joined it together across the cages. The extrusions of the lab animals failed Ugh. to try morphs. It's disgusting. No name badge. Five hundred and twenty-five shots. Deborah Trask, Daylog, Biolab, August 8th, 2018, 7.30 a.m. Research into vaccine for worst case scenario in progress. File Aries Contagion, Password Triune. Microfossil bacteria remains semi-active. Some resemblance to terrestrial cyanobacteria, size ranging from 1 to 100 microns, depending on oxygenation and exposure to UV. On Earth, these microbes would enlarge and multiply at a prodigious rate. They'd cover the planet in months. Further tests still show slight reaction to acid immersion, but the effect is temporary. Explanation of their survival over an estimated 4 billion years may lie in the peculiar tripartite configuration, involving forms approximating bacillus, coccus, and spirillum, combined in single semi-crystalline structures. The rocks still move as if there is psychic wind in the corridors and chambers, and they sing to me. Something tells me they're singing my requiem. Most of the crew will be going down to the necropolis soon. I'm staying right here. 11.42 p.m. Something's wrong in the necropolis. Haraway shouted on the intercom, telling us not to go down there. As if I needed telling. A quarter to midnight. I looked into the microscope. I looked at the bacteria. And the bacteria looked back. The bacteria looked back.
Wow, for as much as this game is shitty, that gave me chills, actually. That's really creepy. Ugh. Oh, whoa. I didn't... I didn't think there'd actually be stuff left in the vac tube. White tag. What place required a white tag? Mei Ling, my new supervisor, they look. Uh, to hell with all that. You're right, Angel. We should have disobeyed orders. Now we are dead for sure. Or worse. It was 11.45 when they opened the regal tomb. And I saw what happened next. People running. People screaming. People changing. I remember your warning about the contention. So I stay clear of biolog. Something tells me I've been infected and I don't want to pass it on to you. I make straight for Jolob if it's empty. If the vac tube's working, I have get this message through to you. Jolob's deserted. No sign of any trouble here. Quarantine procedures seem to be in operation. Oh hell, I should have locked the mining side door with my talk. Just didn't think of it in all the panic. I go and look for him. Jolab's been breached. Something's holding through the vent. Something big. It's where we found their faces. And they're all looking at me. I can't get out. I'll send this message through with the tech right now. Run like hell to the mining site and lock the door, would you? Hope you and John survive all this. You're a remarkable woman, Mei Lin. Okay, um... I don't know what I could use against the Trimorph animals. Some sort of acid or bomb. But I don't think I have any. What about the syringe? Maybe I could fill the syringe with something nasty and inject it into the flesh? I don't know, but anyway, alright, so what does that white tag go to? Shit, I mean, which one's white? They're all just blank. I don't remember where it was. I remember coming across it, but I don't remember where. I'm not sure. Alright, well, there's a couple things I can try. One is to fill the syringe with nasty crap to inject into that stuff. Well, that's my blood sample done. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I just took my own blood sample. Uh, what do I do with it? Obviously, I'm going to be doing a test on the blood sample, but have I not found the place to do that yet? Huh. Well, that's that idea right out of the door. Alright, well, she gave me a password. Which I believe is to this com... Nope. Never mind. Not this computer. I believe is to... Is to... Anticipation. Is... To... This... Com... Nope. Wrong one. This one? Nope. This one. Yes, I believe it's to this computer. Hey, how's it going? This computer, I think.
Here we go. Alright, so it was Triune. No? Oh, no, it's one, two, three, four, five. Damn it, it needs to be five letters. I have all these passwords for all the computers, but I don't see the files to use the passwords on. Alright, where do I go from here? Let me look at the walkthrough, because I actually don't know where to go from here. And I'm sure any solutions I would come to would be found through endlessly wandering through obnoxious corridors. Alright. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Don't open the Grey Door at Picc uh, Piccadilly Circus until after you found the two Martian rocks and the resonator. I don't think I found a resonator. When you enter Geolab, it triggers a nasty series of events where paranormal activities starts damaging your team members every couple minutes. It's not life-threatening damage, but it does get annoying to just... Uh, so just wait a little longer. Wait, so that does damage you? Oh, shit. I guess I need to make this thing sing its song before I die. Okay, let's see what I need to do. Okay, I looked at the walkthrough, and now I know what I need to do for at least the immediate future. Okay, I need to go back to Kenzo, and I need to go back to that room with the Trimorph and the whole buggy and the magnetic checker thing. Apparently, you can actually search the room a little bit without getting killed. And apparently, by the way, you're also, you also are supposed to use the buggy and the checker to get that spectrometer. So I was doing it right, so why it wasn't magnetizing and getting caught on the buggy, I have no idea. Maybe you just weren't supposed to do it then, so the game didn't allow you to? I don't know. But either way, yeah, I can get the resonator that I need from that room from the body sitting in it. So let's go do that. Let me just get her to a safe place. Alright, and I'm going to use her to save the game right before I start doing the dangerous stuff inside of there. Alright, just... She's in a safe place. He's in a safe place. Okay, I have the baby bug. I have the remote. I have the magnetic checker. A magnetic checker. So that's all good. And that is everything I need. All right, let's go. It's back through the Hall of Terrible Zombies. How many shots do you have? Twenty. That's... nothing. Shit. Oh, well. It's gonna be back to mashing the keys for me. Time to do the dead man's walk. This is the wrong way. Actually, hold on. What? Is this require white? What is this? Okay, that's white tag. Well, I guess I probably don't need that yet. What's in here again? Uh, nothing good. Alright, well, I don't need that. Okay. Wait, I'm going the wrong way again. This is the way to go. Oh, 
Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> this is so stupid. Okay, pass the first two. Past another two. Ooh, these are asleep. Okay, whew. Alright, that saved a lot of time. Okay. So, now it's time to save. One save free. I don't remember what save I'm on. I'm gonna go for 14. I think it might be 13, but whatever. 14? I don't actually know what happens if you try to name a save game the same. I assume it would tell you there's a conflict, but I don't know. Okay. Apparently, if you walk really carefully, you can go in here without the thing poun pouncing on you. So, what is it? Go to Kenzo's left, right? Uh... Walk slowly towards Kenzo's left, and the camera view will change. You should see a back tube and a body on the ground. Search the body and carefully send the resonator screwdriver and the pumice stone through the back, back tube. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Resonator. Wow, I don't even have a health boost. Alright, I'll take that. I'll take that. Do I have nails already? I do, already, I do already have nails, so I might as well stack up on some more. I don't want the nail gun, though, because it blows. Now, can I get to the back tube? Come on. Oh, oh. I saw it, I saw it. Where is it, where is it? Okay, come on. Seriously? Oh, whoa, oh. A search dead body, oh fuck this, come on. There. Use vac tube. I don't need that. But anyway, send the resonator up. What do I need the spectrometer for? I don't know. Let me try to... Let me use the spectrometer right now. I mean, not the spectrometer. Let me use the baby bug. This thing should work. Does that Trimorph seriously not realize I'm, like, ten feet away from it? Why the fuck doesn't this work? I don't know. I don't think I actually need it yet, though. And I think later on I can actually kill this Trimorph. So I'm just gonna leave that. <laughs> now. Here's something interesting that the walkthrough mentions. That door I was just looking at, the baby bug. Alright, here's what it says. Side note. 
Now, if you're feeling brave, it's possible to get past this room without killing the Trimorph. To get past the Trimorph, you'll need to make a dash for the other door. You can acquire the best weapon in the game for Kenzo on the other side, the Sayonara. I recommend waiting until after you get the Flare Gun, but it is possible to get the Sayonara at this point in the game. Can you guess what I'm going to do? Oh boy, I'm going right in here. Oh yeah. Let's just leave that baby right here. No, I'm going to leave it here. Okay. <laughs> I actually remember doing this when I... Oh, shit. That's starting to hurt a bit. I actually remember doing this when I originally played the game. And I remember you have, like, practically no extra time. So, here we go. Whew. It didn't even seem to see me. Alright, well, what the hell's in here? Maybe it's on the way back that it doesn't see me? I don't know, or maybe it's bugged. Why won't the door open? It's not telling me anything. Like, does it require a tag, or what? I don't even know where I am. Where am I? I'm somewhere between 41st Street and Lonely Street. Hold on, let me figure out the lay of the land. Alright, so there's a pathway there. Where did... Oh, shit. Alright, where does this go? Wait, where is that? Holy shit, there's so many places I can go. Okay, well, let's go back and do the first door. Funny thing is, is I might die trying to get out of here. <laughs> trying to get past the Trimorph. Well, something just awoke. I believe this is another entrance to the door I can't go into. Yeah, that's the one I can't open. And I don't think I can ever open it. I think you need a certain team member to do it. Or something like that, like only one person can enter it. Alright, so that place is a bust. Let's see what's over here. Okay, so this is another airlock. Wait, which airlock is this? I don't see any airlocks on the map. I should be somewhere on the right of the map. Huh. Um... Is that that ghost that everyone was talking about? All of the crew members? Hi. M may I pass? Excuse me. Okay, so that's how it is, huh? All right. All 
All right, last door. Who's shooting? The fuck? There's someone else alive? Well, at least I got some more ammo. I just got fucking capped by a zombie. What? Uh, I'm confused. I am very, very confused. Does it ever co Oh god, it does come after you, okay. <laughs> oh no, why did those things show up? Lame. Alright, let's just test this out super fast. Wait, do I have any health? No, where did, where did I get the health from? I need a health, because it seems like that thing's gonna kill me in one shot. I think it was on one of the bodies. Body was it on? Uh, nope. Seriously, wasn't it on one of the bodies? Or am I going crazy? Oh, here we go. The Hold on, excuse me. While you're getting up, let me take your. Oh shit, it's a wait, it's an antitoxin? What? Maybe I'm thinking of a different character. Alright, fuck it. I don't know if the reason I died was a health thing, or maybe I'm not supposed to do it yet, or maybe I need to come from the other side. I really don't know. Who's shooting? Well, let's give it a shot. Wait a minute, what if I... <laughs> let's do this. Dun 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 dun! Serpentine! Yeah, I get the feeling that I'm supposed to come at this from the other side. So, there's a zombie, it's shooting a weapon, and it has unlimited ammo. Okay, that makes sense. Sure. Why not? Yeah, I think I'm supposed to come at this from the other side. But, let's give it a shot. Uh... The scene didn't change, okay. Let me see if I can shoot him. Shit, okay. Wow. Uh, I think you shot me a couple times. Yeah, I'm almost dead. Uh... 
And they were consider enough to considerate enough to give me a health boost. Thank you. Alright, what is this? Is this a Dillinger? Ooh. Alright, what do I have? 48 that. And... Yeah, I have way more Dillinger ammo than Piccolo, and it's more powerful, I believe, so let's use it. Storeroom one key. Storeroom. Can't think of what that would open. Won't open. Someone's cut out a hole in the lock. Oh damn. Went down on two shots. Someone's cut a hole in the lock. Uh, okay, do I have anything that could work? I mean, what the hell would I put in there? It won't open because someone cut a hole in the lock, so how do you open it? Uh, shove a syringe? Nope. Okay, I think my work here is done, because I think I'm not even supposed to be here. Yeah, yeah, stop screaming. Alright, let's hope I don't die. Whew. I didn't. Okay, now let's do this over again. Search the body, grab the resonator. Oh, this is where I got the health boost from. That's right. Don't need any of that shit. Alright, put the resonator in, go up, and my work here is done. I am safe in this doorway and I will perpetually stay here for the rest of my life. Now, let me see what the hell I do with that resonator. Hold on. Alright, give him the pumice stone, blah blah blah, already do that. If you have the two Martian rocks and the resonator, you can now go ahead and enter Geolab, or you can use the red tag and enter the Biolab, doesn't matter which room you decide to do first, because we'll be doing them back to back. Okay, so this is the place with the Martian rocks, and the shaped rocks and all of that, so this is Matlock's business. Alright, creepy statue. Activity starts emanating from the statue, causes your team to lose health every couple of minutes. Search the body for some items, and then go past, go past the body and check the drawer in the very back. It's easy to miss because it's almost behind the statue. Wait, there's a drawer behind the statue? What? Indeed, I missed it. Thank you for telling me. <laughs> okay. So you do need all four rocks. Okay. So... Let's oh, shit, I don't have room. Well, this is for Kenzo, so I'm gonna leave that in there, and I'm gonna take this. Shit, I need more room. I need, get, I need to get rid of all these micro-recorders. I think this is full. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. Okay. Alright, uh, here? Yeah. Alright, so there's a drop. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
Alright, there's a drawer almost behind the statue. Uh, where? Here? What the fu- <laughs> The drawer is literally out of frame. What the hell? Are you kidding me? Alright, well I'm gonna leave that herb there, because I don't really have inventory space for it. Let's place that in. Okay, now there's one hole left, and that's where we go back to the walkthrough. You should only have one hole left now. Indeed, I do. Now, if you remember Pikmin's note from earlier, there was a picture of this statue on it. If you look at the picture closely, you'll see the abbreviation C6 over one of the holes. Go back to the computer, use the... Oh, shit, that's right! C6, I remember that from the picture. Okay, so C6 is the dig site. Six. Go, my rover. Row for me. And now we wait. Actually, now I read ahead to figure out what I need to do next. I guess you probably put it in and then use the resonator on it and the psychic emanations stop. Alright, so you get the final Martian rock, put it in the cutting... Oh, God. Good. Fucking terrible. And then we cut the rock, of course. Use the resonator on the statue, and the psionic spell will be broken. Hello, my friend. Never before has a simple rock been a sweeter sight. Okay, let's stop the psionic damage. It's hurting my brain. Whoa. The music's gone away for now. What the hell did I just see? Something has just vacuumed all the ghosts out of my skull. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Well, it apparently didn't get rid of the ghosts that are here. Why is she not moving? Not that I'm going to complain, but okay. All right. All right, so this is on to the bio lab. Okay. This is Biolab, yep. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty much just using a walkthrough, like, constantly at this point, because trust me, this game will be twice as long as it should be if you don't use a walkthrough. It's horrible. You'll eventually need to find a way to cut through the webbing, but don't worry about it for now. When you finish the lab, send the white tag and the spiritus remote. Oh. Send the white tag and the spiritus remote over to Kenzo. Your destination will be the white door at the very end of Boulevard St. Michelle. I know exactly where that is, but I didn't know he needed the Spiritus remote, so I'll do that. You know... Isn't it bizarre, the things you remember from old... You know, old stuff? Like an old movie or an old game? You remember these bizarre tiny details that seem irrelevant, but you forget lots of big picture things? Like something just came back to me right now. The Spiritus remote? Okay, let me see if my memory is correct. 
I believe the Spiritus remote is used to turn off some sort of remote controlled fireplace with Kenzo. No, I'm not kidding. Some sort of remote controlled fireplace. That's what my memory is telling me, and let's see if it matches up with reality. Oh yes, that's right, I need to get out of here, damn it. You know, I'm just gonna shoot my way through. Fuck all y'all zombs. Much better. Much, much better. I like how you turn around and then you're not turned around when it attacks you, like that, again. Just happened twice in a row. How the fuck did that miss? Come on. Alright, I need to hit up dorm room number two to get the vac tube, to get the spiritus remote. Where the fuck is the white tag? Hold on. I thought I didn't I put it in the vac tube? Where is it? Where the fuck is it? Did I leave it un did I not tube it? Like did I put it in the vac tube but not actually use it? Hold on. Is it here? Ah, oh, thank god, there it is. Okay. Wait a minute. Hold on. Cannot leave stuff just sitting there in the back tube, that's a bad idea. Alright, is there a storage compartment in here I can shove shit in? Because I have way too much stuff. Uh, apparently I can't... Oh, there I can... Oh, okay. Uh, what do I not need? What do I not need? Shit, do I need everything? Well, I'll be damned. I think I need everything. I'm not sure about these key cards, but I really can't spare them. All right. Eh, whatever. I like if they how if they haven't finished their animation, you can't shoot them. They're invincible. That's so dumb.
Holy shit. This place is beautiful. Oh, this is a Diabolus. Wait, do I have room? Oh yeah, I used up the tag. So it's a machine gun? Karn would love to have this. Oh fuck Karn. I'm gonna use it. Wait a minute, that can't be a machine gun, it only holds six rounds. Wait, what? Uh, what? It holds six bursts? What the fuck? Okay. Whatever. Guns don't shoot bursts, they shoot rounds. They shoot bursts of rounds, but why the hell would the ammo indicator be in bursts? Ah, <sighs> this game. Apparently there was Diabolus ammo in there. Somewhere. I think I need a screwdriver. But I don't have one. I don't suppose there's a back tube in here? Oh, whoa, ooh. Ooh. Alright, let's save that for last. What do I see there? I see a fireplace. I think my memory was correct. Out of all the things I remember from this game, I remember the fucking remote in the fireplace. Don't get it, but okay. Needle and thread. Um. Alright. Don't have room for it yet. Seriously, this room is incredibly beautiful. There really is some really good background art in this game. Cool. Did... Did he just describe the fireplace as cool? Cool. Uh. Bingo. Bla... What? The... There's a black tag in there? Are these things fireproof? And melt-proof? I, I mean... Why is there a black ta... What? There's a keycard in the fireplace. What? Alright, well obviously I don't need the remote anymore. Uh, given that I have the Dillinger and now I have 714 bursts, I believe, of the Diabolus, I don't think I'm gonna need the Piccolo anymore, so fuck that. I'm gonna put a piccolo in a jar. Take the needle and thread and let's grab the black keycard. I'm sorry, black tag, it's a keycard. Which I believe is opened, uh, used to open the dig site. Yep, all the way on the top left. All right, so that's for Matlock. Oh yeah, computer. Wow, I almost forgot. Oh, okay, there's also a drawer there. What drawer did I just open? Because that table doesn't have any drawers. Have a good look at that table. Look at it. Do you see any drawers? What drawer did I just open? I don't understand. Alright, how many sa- before I do saves actually, let's see what's on here. Any good juicy restricted things? No. Man, sir, I have three Passwords for computers. I have Hammer, Trident, and Triune. And I haven't found any place to use any of them. Where the hell are they used? Alright. 
I guess they weren't too inventive with this computer. I think it's just meant as a save spot. And how many saves do we have? Two. Save... What am I on? I'm gonna go with 15. Alright, well, let's send the black tag over to Matlock. You know what, I want to test this weapon out. It's satisfying to you. Oh, whoa. I was going to say it's crap, but it actually attacks multiple enemies at the same time. Which doesn't make any sense, but I like it. Yeah, it's not very powerful, but it's good for group control. Hmm. Alright, well, I can use the screwdriver. So I will take that, and I will send that up. Yeah, it doesn't appear to do anything when they're in their getting up animation. Like, wait, and then... Oh. Whoops. Waited too long. Then you gotta wait, then you're good to go. And you gotta wait, then you're good to go. Oh my god. The combat in this game is such crap. Wait a minute. This is the... No, no, this is the right way. I think. No, it's not. This takes way too long. Come on. Alright, let me switch to something more powerful. This really should be safe for groups. Dillinger is good for single enemies. Yeah, that's a bit better. Bingo. I don't suppose I can place the buggy in this. Too small for me. That gap's too small, and my shoulders are too wide. That's my story. Alright, still can't use the buggy. I guess it's for Matlock to use, maybe? Actually, I might as well stay in here. Yeah, I'm just gonna hang out in here. Alright, let's go to the dig site area place. What is an area, if not a place? The dig site area place? Site area and... Place all mean the same thing, but whatever. Ah, great, one of those things. Oh, hello. Bingo. Laser scalpel? That's gotta be used to get through the flesh. And a Dillinger, hello. And I have a shit ton of Dillinger ammo. Sweet. This laser scalpel looks like a tricorder. I 
have eight health boosts. Wow. Well, you can never have too many health potions, right? Potions. Uh, turn around, turn around. Go. Holy shit. Well, I got what I came for. Goodbye. Let's go cut some flesh. My favorite thing to do. Mmm, smells like bacon. Yeah. What the fuck am I looking at? Looks like I'm looking at the feet, the legs of some sort of Frankenstein monster. What the hell? Thermalizer. If I can get a sample of the original contagion source, I can superheat it in the thermalizer. So I guess the thermalizer is basically just a heater? That's what it means to thermalize something? Heat it? Okay, I mean, do I use my blood sample? Nope. Alright, don't think I need to use that yet. Microscope. Under an electron microscanner, any bacteria in our blood will show up larger than tadpoles in a pond. All I need are blood samples from each of us, and a trimorph tissue sample. And a trimorph tissue sample. Okay, well that's... <laughs> How the hell am I going to get a trimorph tissue sample? Well, I still have the laser scalpel, so I guess I have to kill one of the trimorphs and then cut some flesh out? Yeah. I like laser scalpels. You and me both. It may look like pure Frankenstein, but I've a notion the gun was operating with some alien science here. How do you know gun was responsible for this? And what the hell is this thing? Centrifuge. This has been adapted to separate blood types and simultaneously combine them with another substance. Hmm. Oh. Ben Gunn's blood sample. Okay, well, I guess I'll put mine in. Yeah, I guess we just put all of our blood samples in. Use corpse with... Laser scalpel. Nope, didn't work. Alright, let me make sure I didn't miss any hot spots. I think the only thing left to do is check out the computer. Whoops. Gruesome. All right, what? Oh. All right, well, hopefully it's one of the past one, two, three, four, five... Shit. I don't have anything that's five letters. Uh, or five numbers, whatever it is. Uh, yeah, I think I just don't have it yet. Okay, well, no matter. This is a perfect place to end this episode here, actually. Actually, never mind, it's not perfect. I can't access the computer, so I can't save it. Which means I can't end. Hold on. Just a minute. Uh, 
I believe I have a save left here. Before I save it, let me take care of her. Okay. That way when I come back, I don't have a zombie trying to eat my face. Okay, I hope you have enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.